I left my boyfriend and I've been traveling for 10 days and I've slept with 22 people in that 10 days. My goal was 20 and I just hit 22 this morning. It's Bro, 22 people in 10 days, that is diabolical. That is demonic behavior. 22 people in 10 days? That means she was having two days, bro. Oh my God. 1 p.m. now here in Paris and I need to check out because I'm going home. I really doubt I'm gonna get another one on the board either on the plane or like on my layover. So I think 22 is where we're gonna cap it out. But how did I go? She went to Paris and turned into a serial killer. Imagine how her boyfriend feel. She must have never seen National Geographic uncut. Baby girl, them orangutans, they'll do that to you. Them gorillas, they'll do that to you. You writing a check that them cheeks ain't ready to cash. I'm just letting you know that right now. Okay, good afternoon. My name is Azario Carruthers. I formerly was living as Ashley Shalani Carruthers. God made me a man. The devil tricked me into being trans, and now God has called me back. Today, I want to invite whoever wants to go on this journey of deliverance with me. I want to invite you. The devil is a liar, and you have to publicly acknowledge that he's a liar. And so, my pronouns are he and him. Again, my name is Azario. I am what they call detransitioning. I call it, I am on my journey of deliverance because God made me a man, and a man I shall be. This is going to be a long journey. But I promise you, you're going to see the victory at the end because God is good and it's never too late. Let's go. This is my first time coming across a video like this, so I got I to gotta handle it with care. Um, uh, congratulations to you, brother. Congratulations on refining yourself. The only thing, ladies, let me ask you a question. Would you be able to date a man that was playing for the other team and decided to um, come back home? Find MILFs on Facebook Marketplace. Share this to everybody you know. Okay, the first way is very simple. You're going to type in a wedding ring near me, and then you can find somebody from here because we all know nobody's selling their wedding ring unless they're divorced or single. And then after you find your person, you can talk to them from here. Or you can meet up with them in real life and act like you're going to buy the ring. But here's the catch. See, you weren't even thinking about this. You can filter from highest to lowest, which means you can choose how rich you want the bitch. Have you ever just went on GTA and spawned in money? This is basically what that is. But if you don't like that way, you can type in wedding dresses. Because who's selling wedding dresses? Miserable divorced women that want a young buck like you to come through and change their life. And the crazy thing about the wedding dresses is you can filter by size. This is, <laughs> this is like customizing who you get to be in bed with. This is crazy. If you like big girls, go for it. Nobody's stopping you. And just like the wedding ring, you can also pick how rich you want her to be. So you can basically have like a rich skinny girl, a poor big girl, a middle class fat girl. It don't matter, bro. There's no limits to this. You can scale this out however you want. Share this to your friends. Go ahead and clap it up for his weed man, dog. Go ahead and clap it up for his weed man. Who sits there and think about stuff like this? 
This is an ingenious pothead theory. What, what, what question are you asking me? Ask a question. I'm, I'm asking why you're mad because I posted a filter. Filters is not real. It's bullshit. It's a sell of product of something that you are not. Mm. So you're telling everybody they're supposed to be something that they are. Mm. Stop selling this bullshit. You're mad because I posted a, the most natural a, black woman is the most beautiful black mm, woman. Preach fact, that. Your imperfections is everything. Preach that. Okay, but I'm, I'm, preach I'm that. recording you because I'm trying to figure out why are you yelling for one and why are you angry because I posted a TikTok. Because, I, because I, you I, know what? Can I finish my sentence? I used a TikTok filter. Use a TikTok filter? Yeah, it did. To look like what? No, it, it looked like. To I, do what? But it's. Hey, hold on. I don't know if y'all caught how she was basically gaslighting him. That passive aggressive, I'm just recording you because I wanted to. First off, why are you yelling? My boy, <laughs> get up out of there now. It's not that far, you know, from what? Remove from like, what? Remove from what? That's fine. It's just, I look like I had on makeup. It's far so removed. So you think black women and white it's women? Far, no, it's all of y'all. It's far removed from what the man lays down with. Mm. Oh. Mm. And what you wake up with. Mm. Mm. And what you, we deal with. Mm. With children, not children, whatever. What the hell are you asking me? Mm -hmm. What is reality to, to you? What is reality to you? Of mm. what? Um, of reality? No. <sighs> yeah, you can't get me on this. You will never post this. She will. New Year's Eve ready. And she still posts the filter. Black women, white women, Hispanic women, Asian women, Indian women. I want y'all to know that y'all don't need these filters. You are beautiful the way you are. Just like I don't think y'all need BBLs. I don't think y'all need breast enhancements. I don't think y'all need any of these things. It's somebody out there that's going to find you beautiful. You know, yesterday I was watching this video where this chick was talking about um, she told her man to get off social media. He don't need social media. And she had a point about social media being a distraction. I honestly do feel like this is the type of distraction that social media is coming with. Like, this is poisoning us. The people you see on social media, some of them really don't look like that. Perfect example, I have an app on my phone. I remember a few weeks ago, my camera was in the shop and... I had to use my phone. There's an app on my phone that once I start editing the videos, I can change how slim my face appears. I could change how slim my body appears. I can make myself look swole. I can make myself look skinny. There's literally an app on, on my phone for that, just to edit in the videos. I did not know. That was my first time coming across this shit, bro. That was my first time I could change the size of my nose. So now, of course, I'm not using that because as a man, I don't feel as I should be using that. What man is using that? But honestly, what woman should be using that? You shouldn't be using that. Motherfucker should accept you the way you are. I would never come on social media and try to create this facade that I have to live up to. I'd rather come on here and be myself every single day. If you don't like it, fuck you. 